in the last couple of weeks, one of the big tech stories to create discussions all over the world has been around the release of ChatGPT, which stands for Chat Generative Pre-Trained Transformer a piece of AI that's able to have a conversation with you that feels like you're talking to a human. One of its big achievements is to be able to connect up statements from one inquiry to the next. So it's not just responding to that specific immediate inquiry, it also is able to take into account the things that came before it. So it really feels like it's listening to you, it's engaged in the conversation, and is making a meaningful contribution to the discussion, which is a massive transformation to some of the conversations we've had within chatbots in the past. The discussions about it are focused on the future of AI, what it means in a world in which we can blur the boundaries between human and machine. These discussions which take us all the way back to the work of Alan Turing and his famous imitation game. The point at which we can't tell the difference between the human and the machine is the point at which we determine that machines have become sufficiently intelligent for us to treat them as entities in their own right. Now I asked the chatbot today, what are the implications of this technology? How should we feel about a world in which AI has its own aims, its own intentions? And the responses were really interesting. They focused mostly on trying to essentially diminish the concern that this in fact is possible, that the idea that AI can become somehow having its own volition beyond what it's been programmed is one of the key tensions in this whole subject. Can it go beyond what we program or is it entirely the product of what we put into the machine? I tend to think that in fact the entire foundation of AI is reliant on the idea that in fact it does go beyond what we program, that it is capable of learning and for those learnings to develop insights that then may surprise us, that give us knowledge that we hadn't anticipated. But of course the consequence of that is that we're also subject to a world in which AI has its own plan beyond the one we program for it. Whether we're comfortable with that or not, time will tell, but it's certainly a bigger part of our future and something we really have to come to terms with. So I encourage you all to get online and try out ChatGPT. It's a fantastic experience, really imaginative and creative. and gets you thinking about the implications of technology in lots of different ways.